Tent caterpillars are a problem across Canada, and we brought in Jessica Daw, the bug lady. Jessica, when people have this kind of problem in their fruit trees or maybe uh, other ornamental trees, what do you do with them? And is it always the best thing to just cut out the tent? Oh, well, that depends on the severity of the problem, how many tents you actually have. Um, you always want to leave a few, um, a little bit of the pest in order to support the beneficials that um, okay. that feed on these. Okay. Um, things like tachnid flies and wasps and uh, and other um, parasitic creatures that um, that um, use them as, as a source of reproduction. Okay, now you've got a little nest right there and these things are just, obviously the sun is getting them all hot and bothered and active all over. Now, how do you tell if one has been parasitized? Because I understand that there is actually a wasp that would come down and actually lay eggs right on the caterpillar. Well, um, what you're actually talking about there is a tachnid fly. So it, okay. is a, it is a type of fly. And what you would be seeing is um, a lily white egg right on the top of the head. Okay. Um, sometimes two or three of these eggs on top of the head. And the, the fly, as a maggot, burrows into the, into the body and feeds and um, eventually emerges as a fly. <laughs> what a way to go, eh? <laughs> <laughs> so if you see one of those, you should basically, are you saying leave them? So leave that, that one for sure, yeah. Okay. Um, because you want, of course, you want those um, those flies to proliferate so that, um, that you've got more of them around to protect your garden. Okay. Now what else would you see happening uh, on your fruit trees with these, uh, these kinds of insects around? Are we seeing other types of beneficials in your trees? Absolutely. What you're going to see is, is a lot of wasps flying around the tree. There's a direct response um, to wasp populations and, and populations of tent caterpillars. Okay. So um, uh, wasps are great predators and often underrated, yeah. uh, but they do take care of quite of uh, they do take care of the uh, the tent caterpillar. And what if, well. what do they do to them? What do the wasps do to them? Uh, they just eat them. Oh really? <laughs> they, <laughs> they just pick them up they all just, away. They just grab them like a hot dog and and, and eat them up. <laughs> Absolutely. Well, on that happy note, <laughs> thanks again for coming out and giving us all that great information. Thanks a lot, Gord.